Right, let's learn an E major. And the other thing I'm going to tell you before we go in and learn this is the guitar is a very um, shape orientated instrument, more so than a piano, where say all the notes are just laid out in front of you and it's just a succession of the same ish carrying on all just in front of you. Here, there's a certain character to the types of chords and some of them have similarities to each other, even though they're completely wildly different chords, just because their shapes might look a bit similar. So it's a shape learning instrument. So think of it in terms of learning shapes. So you've learnt a shape, that kind of line across the middle that gives you the A, those three in the middle kind of star shape. And now we're going to learn a different kind of shape. We're going to learn an E. This one's going to play all six strings. So when the A played only the bottom five strings, this one's going to play all six strings. So the shape, and we're going to use our fingers and frets so you can find out where to go. We go finger one, the index finger, is on the G string. We go middle finger on the A string. And we go wedding ring finger on the D string. And we play the E string open and the bottom E string and B string open as well. So start from the bottom, E string open, B string open. The G string is fretted here at the first fret. The D string is fretted here at the second fret. The A string is fretted here at the second fret. And the E string is open. The E, uh, the little finger, the pinky finger, is not used at all. And there we go. And so you've learnt that shape, and it's kind of that um, two at the top, and then one across and down from it. And that's a particular kind of shape. And you'll see that shape appearing again, just like you'll see the A shape appearing again as well in different guises. Now you're familiar with these two, you can start switching between them. Remember the A is only the bottom five strings, and the E is all six strings. And you can get faster and faster with practice. You can start switching and getting faster with practice like that. But don't get too carried away or frustrated. You can go slowly. <laughs> 